Today I am going to teach how to use substitution method for integration. So, topics for today is integration by substitution. Okay. Before I start substitution method, I would like to give an example why we need substitution. Okay. Consider the problem. the 6 dx. What is the integral of this? What is the integral? Okay. We don't know as of now, right? As of now, we don't know because this is different from x. If it were, Like what we know is if it were g to the 6 dz, we know how to integrate it, right? Because this variable dz, this is the differential of g and this is g to the 6, we know that g to the 7 over 7 plus constant of integration. That's why the problem with this is, this is different from x. If it were x to the 6 dx, it would have been x to the 7 over 7 plus c. So the problem is this term being different from x. Okay, then is there any way we can reduce this expression in into this. If we could, then we can proceed and find the integration. Okay, then I would say this, by substitution we can change this problem into the problem like this. Okay, then how do we do that? Let's see. Let z equals 2x plus 3. If z equals 2x plus 3, you know dz over dx is 2 and dz will be 2 dx. This is the differentiating both sides with respect to x. dz over dx, derivative of 2x is 2, derivative of 3 is 0, right? And I multiplied both sides by dx, so dz is 2dx. Then what is the integral then? This integral would be, let's go there. Let me keep a little bit of space because I want to play with this relation later. Then 2x plus 3 to the 6 dx is I have isn't this quantity to be z, right? g to the 6. Now, I want to replace dx by something like in terms of z. So, let me go back to this relation. What is dx? From this relation, dx is dz over 2, right? Divide both sides by 2. Okay, you see the point. Okay, then let's go back to this. Z to the 6, dx is dz over 2. This is dz over 2. And this is a constant, so I can pull out constant out. That is half integral of z to the 6, dz. See? 
if z to the 6 dz, then we can integrate right away. So integral of this would be of, what is the integral of z to the 6? z to, z to the 7 over 7 plus constant of integration, right? So this is z to the 7 over 14. Mm -hmm. Half times c is another constant. Let me say c1. Where c1 is constant of integration. Does that make sense to you? Yes. Okay. G is something we introduced here to make the problem simpler. So let's put back the value of z. g is 2x plus 3 to the 7 over 14 plus c. You might want to write like c1 where c1 is the constant of integration. Does that make sense? Okay, let's do next problem. Let's do another example. Let's do example second, okay? I have a bunch of problems I copied from your textbook. Let's work on this. Let's work on this problem. 3x squared, x cubed plus 1 to the 10 dx. We want to integrate it. Okay. I don't want to repeat that big expression. Let me say i. Okay. Can you guess what we want to substitute for to make it prop? Make the problem simpler? x cubed plus 1. Okay, good guess. Perfect. Let u equals x cubed plus 1. What is du? What do you think du is? 3x squared dx, right? 3x squared dx. Do I need to explain this? No. Are you sure you are clear how we got dx here? Okay, good, good. Then, let's go back to the problem. See, i equals integral. This is our u. u to the 10. u to the 10. See, what is the remaining part in the integral sign? The remaining part is this, right? 3x squared dx. Look here. 3x squared dx is nothing but du, right? Okay. Then this is du, which is readily integrable. What is integral of u to the 10? u to the 11 over 11 plus constant of integration. Okay, let's put back the value of u. The value of u is x q plus 1 to the 11 over 11 plus constant of integration. This is the integral we are looking for. Does that make sense? Are you clear how we use substitution? Yes. Okay. I hope with those two examples, with these two examples, you have kind of idea how to use substitution. Yeah, I have collected a bunch of more problems in the note I kept in Blackboard. Please try the rest of the problems. If you have any questions, let me know. Thank you.